Hey guys, I'm Anna, and today we're going to learn how to make squiggly text effect in Premiere Pro. So without further ado, let's dive into it. The effect we are making today looks like kind of underwater squiggly text. However, the tool I'm going to show you can be used for many purposes, such as many types of distorted text, elements and videos themselves. So definitely have fun with it, as it's very useful creative tool. But now let's return to our squiggly text, aka underwater text in Premiere Pro. First we start with typing the text. Obviously, uh, you can choose whatever font you like, but I find that bold non-cursive fonts with all caps are the most suitable for the effect. So that's why I'm gonna choose Helvetica Bold and type Ocean Life with all caps. Let's adjust uh, the text duration. And now we're gonna apply turbulent displace effect to the text layer. You can find this feature either in the effects uh, tab in the top menu, then open the effects window and uh, search for turbulent displays. Or if you're working from editing panel, press the arrows from the bottom left corner and you'll find the same effects panel. Drag the effect to the text layer and now all we have to do is to adjust its settings and to animate it. Make sure your text layer is selected, go to the effect controls tab and find turbulent displays. Now let's see uh, what each of these settings does. Well, you can select different types of displacement, let's say compare turbulent turbulent smoother and uh, twist. You see that um, they have a different pattern and um, the curve is different as well. But I will leave uh, my displacement as um, just turbulent. The next setting is uh, called uh, the amount and it defines the amount of distortion. So you can see the difference between the large amount and then uh, the small amount. For my effect, I'll leave it as uh, 37. Size adjust uh, the area of distortion. I would like to change it for the 13. Okay. And evolution uh, changes the turbulence over time. Now, uh, that's a setting that will help us to create the animation. Place the marker at the beginning of the clip and uh, click on a stopwatch next to evolution. As you can see, we've created our first keyframe. It should be at zero uh, for now. Next, move marker to the end of the clip and increase the evolution. You uh, want this to make several turns, so hold the shift to rapidly increase the amount. And also check if the second um, keyframe in the end of the clip was created as you increased uh, the evolution. Preview the clip after adjusting and changing the evolution amount depending on how fast you want the effect to happen. Obviously, the bigger the number in the end of the clip, uh, the more intense your effect will be. I will increase mine a little bit more. Let's check it again. See, now it's more intense. <laughs> Don't forget to ease out the first keyframe and is in the second keyframe, uh, so your animation will uh, play uh, smoother. And now let's render our clip and see the effect in action. Pretty nice, right? You can leave it at that, but I wanted to show you another feature you can use um, to create uh, animation. I will duplicate the clip uh, with um, 
the text i'll leave all settings the same uh, but i will deactivate um, evolution then i will create animation with this um, offset turbulence uh, feature i create first keyframe in the beginning of the clip and define it as 500 then i scroll to the end of the clip create another keyframe and increase the number to 1005 the same as with the previous animations, the larger the number at the end, the more intense your effect will be. We can compare both clips now. As you can see, uh, they have a bit different uh, pattern. So you can switch between them de depending on uh, your situation. And that's how you make squiggly text effect in Premiere Pro. And if you want to find out how to make highlighter effect, check out the video in the description. Bye!